In this video, I'll show you how to recreate Apple's signature liquid glass look on your website. And to make things easier, I'll even link the full code and a downloadable template in the description below so you can copy it, tweak it and try it out the right way. Let's bring some of that Apple magic to your site. First, we are going to create a full screen video background. This gives the glass effect something dynamic to refract against. Start by inserting a full width container and set the minimum height to 100vh. This makes sure it always covers the entire screen no matter the device. Next, go to layout settings and set justify content to center. That will center everything nicely in the middle. Now let's bring the background to life. So go to styles, click on background type. Select a video. You can upload a video to your media library and grab the link from there. Make sure to enable play on mobile so it works across all devices. Once that's done, add another container inside the section. Set its direction to row because this will hold the cards side by side. Inside that row container, add a new container. This will be our first class card. Set a gap of 10 to give it some breathing room. Go to the Advanced tab, scroll to Align Self and set it to Center. Now assign a class name to the container, call it Refraction Card. This is the class we'll use to apply the liquid glass effect later. Now let's build out the content inside this card. First add an icon widget, pick an icon that fits your design, set the size to 50 pixels and pick a color that stands out from your background. Next, insert a heading, style it how you like, change the font, size, and make sure the color has enough contrast. Then add a text editor block for some supporting info. Style this as needed. Finally, drop in a button widget. Now choose a background color and hover color. Set a hover transition duration to make it smooth. Add a border radius of 20 to give it that rounded apple feel. Set the button padding and add an extra 10 pixels of padding around the container for spacing. Once your first card is ready, go ahead and duplicate it three more times. You'll now have a nice row of four matching cards. Change the icons, headings and text in each one to match your content. You can highlight different features, categories or use cases completely up to you. Now let's add the liquid glass effect. Drag an HTML widget into your page, ideally just before your cards. Here paste the SVG code that creates the refraction layer. This SVG acts like a lens behind the scenes, creating the smooth wavy blur. Next, go to custom CSS. If you're using Elementor Pro, this is built in. If you're using the free version, no worries. Just install the WP code plugin and you can paste the same CSS globally or in specific locations. Paste the full CSS that targets the dot refraction card class and just like that, the effect is live. You'll now see your cards floating with a liquid blur blending beautifully with a video underneath. Let's break down what's actually happening behind the scenes so you can tweak it and customize the look. In the SVG code, Base frequency controls the turbulence. Higher values is equal to more ripple. See, it gives the blur its randomness. You can try different values until you get that one that feels just right. STD deviation adjusts the softness, increase this to make the blur smoother and more subtle. Scale controls how much the background appears magnified through the glass. In the CSS, the refraction card class defines the card size and look. Background uses semi-transparency, so lowering the opacity gives you more of that watery effect while increasing it gives a milkier finish. Backdrop filter is where the real magic happens. Blur softens everything behind the card, contrast makes the card pop more against the background, adjust both to dial in your preferred look. We also add a softbox shadow for depth and finally a linear gradient adds a subtle shine or texture to give the card that polished apple feel. You can tweak any of these values to match your design. Subtle changes go a long way with this effect. One final thing before we go, adding visual effects like liquid glass can make your site look incredible. But if your site loads slowly, visitors won't stick around long enough to notice it. 
That's why I recommend using Airlift. It keeps your site lightning fast, even with videos, blur effects, and dynamic content. So now you've got Apple's signature liquid glass look live on your site. Fully customizable and performance ready. Catch you in the next one. Click here if you want to 3x your site speed in just one minute. Trust me, you're gonna love it. Click here and I'll see you there.